I will show you how to use labels with the Chrome extension Prince 2 for Trello. Trello provides labels which you can attach to each card. So as you can see, I've added labels to all of these cards here. So let's click on one and I click on here and you see that this one is done. And if you see the done text here, but it doesn't show here, it just shows the color. And that's the default way that Trello works, which is not very, very helpful. So then if we look at the Prince 2 for Trello extension, you can see that each of the labels contains a text. And that makes it much more easier to read. So let's take a look at the labels which I use here. So if we click on this product, we'll see that it has two labels here. D, done, which stands for document, and P, for accepted, that's the product is accepted. So if we click here, we see that at the top we have D for the documents and P for the products down here. When we start off, let's say we create a product description in the product breakdown structure, and then that's the label then that we use for here. So we say in progress and then done. Then when it goes into the stages and we hand it out to the teams or developers to create it, then we use the labels, these ones. So we say the product is now in development, it's the quality check, and it's accepted. And that's why then at the end of the project, you will see that in the stages, we have two green labels for each of the product because the document, that's the requirements document, has been completed and the product has also been developed and accepted as well. The other labels then are the log register and important or issue. So over here, you see that all of the the items here in the log register have this color here and that label and we have nothing in red so far but if something needs your attention you can just click it red and if you're dealing with an issue you can also then just highlight it with this label here so that's how we use the labels just one more thing as well if you are going to change this and you can it's easy to do this um, just keep the labels short because sometimes you may have two or three labels in the one card so you don't want to go too far out here and the last thing I want to show you is that you can move labels up and down so Trello is quite restrictive in the fact that you have to follow its structure like so of the labels and that's not very very easy to work with but Prince 2 for Trello changes this where you can add in a new color and you can even have the same color twice if you wish and you can move it up and down so let's say we want to move this down here like so that makes it much easier to use okay i think i've covered everything for labels